Hey, wall chasers, everybody needs one of these things, right? Well, probably not, but Terry from Metabo has brought one here to show us, and uh, there's really a good use for this thing, so tell us yeah, about it. Yeah, absolutely are. They are more popular in Europe, where a lot of the construction is done with brick, block, stone. But in the U.S., the applications are for chasing a wall, chasing a floor, meaning you're going to create a groove in the floor right. to embed something. Okay. All right, the popular application, for example, is uh, the security towers you see in a retail application. Okay. They're connected by a wire in the floor. Well, this would chase the floor to allow you to embed that wire. Kind of channel, it. basically, exactly. right? Okay. Exactly, yep. channel. Yep. The tool works on uh, using different spacers. So if we, uh, we loosen this up and show you how they work. There's, uh, standard with the tool, you get two diamond wheels, two five inch diameter wheels. So to change the different width of the chase, you just simply move the, the wheels to a different position by using hmm. the spacers. All right. Okay? Very simple. Okay. One of the other nice features we have though with the tool are two different accessories you can buy. This tool will not only create a chase, but also remove the material between. Okay. When you're using the standard wheels, you'll have a, two slots that you have to come back and chip out with a rotary hammer sure. afterwards. Right. So I have one that, that'll do three eighths. I have one that'll do inch and three eighths wide on it with accessories, greatly speeding up the application to remove yeah, sure. that concrete right. between. Right. Um, nice features here. We have rubberized guide rolls, so it makes it very easy to use on the on the on the uh, on the wall. So if the wheels are on there, you push this tool into the chase. Yeah. All right. You have different settings in, in the depth, okay. so you can cut anywhere from three eighths to inch and three eighths deep, mm -hmm. and from three eighths to inch and five eighths wide. Okay. Using the blades. So basically, you're going to be able to, to recess a variety of utility types of wiring, plumbing, uh, gas lines, all kinds of things. You put them into a concrete wall and keep them out of harm's way. Exactly. Right? That, that is the purpose for the tool. Okay. Yeah. All right. Great. What's the alternative if you don't have this tool? It depends. You can use an angle grinder and, and, uh, and a diamond blade to make the chase, but it's, it uh, creates a lot of dust. Yeah. This is totally dustless with the vacuum system. You hook this to right. a vacuum. It is OSHA compliant. Okay. And we have five inch discs and any, any vacuum is going to have at least 125 CFM. You are OSHA compliant in doing your chase. It, it looks like another step in the development of a lot of uh, task specific types of tools. Where, Absolutely. You, know, you don't make do with something anymore. You, you know, there are tools that are designed to take care of what you need to, to have done. Absolutely. Yeah, great. Yeah. Okay. Hey, well, you know what you can find out on toolbarn.com? You can find it there too, if you want to buy it. Absolutely. Them. So yeah. check it out.